I remember when I played Pilgrim 3 and its unlimited enemy sewer map thing, and boy let me tell you how much you missed out on the repetitive S gameplay, and how you had literally nothing to do but shoot incessant waves of monsters. If you don't remember playing this then you're probably a newborn fetus that's currently sucking on mommy mythies right now. How the fuck could you be so ignorant and uncultured unlike me, and clearly smarter than you and be more successful in life because I played this game before you and therefore I know much more about it than you do. You know what man, I fucking hit this game, it's developers and all it's fucking worth. However, I will continue playing it and grinding both levels for my clans and my fingers on my F142's Pro Max Ultra Mini 48 3 or okay, because I have nothing better to do in my life. This fucking game made me become a goddamn shot in and my parents bought divorce papers and it's all my fault. My mom kept arguing with that about the fact that hell introduced me to video games and computers at the age of five was a detriment to the entire family and more precise in my life. My mom hates me and I hate her. She was terrible. She never accepted my love for video games. Technology. And, um, and my love for my bold waifus check and anime from Danganronpa and the campaign girl from this fucking luck game. She has stopped talking to me ever since I stitched the pillows together the remake version of the aforementioned campaign girl on it to make a homemade buddy pillow because I wouldn't get any pocket money due to the fact that I wouldn't do any of the chores my parents asked me to do because I'm so rebellious. Anyways, mother found the buddy pillow, yelled at herself in disdain, and accordingly called me a waste of nine months. Whatever that means, lol, in the process. What the fuck is her problem, man? What? I have hormones, okay? I want to fuck something in my life, please. Just let me have this one thing, please. But, not a man, which is a woman saying how I've been nothing but a disappointment to her and her parents because I have no friends at school since I made them up because whenever I fucking show up at Pitbull Galeo, it's all the Minecraft for love. And fuck them so much I hate them, it's a Minecraft you fucking love. I am currently expelled from this letter. Fucking soon. And the only thing I will ever live for is Pitbull Gun 3. And the only thing that I have ever loved and that has loved me back. My only purpose in life is to grind silvers for my clan, free him. Procedurally shitting on the other gay clans from 12 year olds who want to have fun. Well, guess what 3 was made of? Um, and they were made to give you dopamine in a sense of dominance that you will never have outside of this game. I digress. It feels like I'm the only one contributing in the damn clan wars because 24 7 gaining currency for my team while they're just sucking off and sucking. They tell me they have school. Attending a loved one's funeral. Or hospital because of the deadly disease that I don't know about blah blah blah. Shut the fuck up, nothing is an excuse for you slacking off and not helping me fend for a fun, you lazy assholes. Here, you have a more productive life than me, fuck off what's it. If I don't see any of you or no random moment, I will fucking kick you from the fun off. Are you sorry for getting so mad but those fucking kids keep getting under my skin? Like bro, I need to watch Hente and Boku no Pico for the plot, like please let me have free time. Uh, speaking of free time, when I'm not grinding for my boys and I wish you I get overwhelmed with a staggering sense of